Tonight, potential new rules for people who fish on the Skyway Fishing Pier. The goal is to keep pelicans safe by minimizing injuries and deaths from fishing gear. 10 Tampa Bay Shannon Clo went to the pier to find out what would change for your next catch. I got experience. I started to fishing when I was three year old. This is Migdrad. All people call me Mike. For most people, hard to pronounce my name. Mike has been fishing here at the Skyway Fishing Pier for 20 years. I love those birds. In the last two decades, he's seen a lot of seabirds die. I never hate nobody in my life, but I hate the people who torture those birds. He says some fishermen neglect the bird's safety. You don't know how many times I argue with the people sometime coming close to fight. He sees how some fishermen don't care. Today, when he reeled in his fishing line, he caught this, someone else's line. Other times, he's pulled out birds entangled in this. FWC says last January, over 600 seabirds had to be rescued from entanglement. To reduce that, FWC is proposing new rules for fishermen. These would include banning fishing gear. One rule would ban sabiki rigs and treble hooks from November to March. Another would ban sabiki rigs year-round for a portion of the pier. Officials also propose limiting fishermen to two poles. Ten fishing rows. They cover spot 50 yards. That's not fair, you know. Speaking of fairness, some fishermen on a virtual call tonight argued pelicans are a problem because rescuers feed them. Fishermen opposing the rules questioning FWC's data, saying banning gear isn't the answer. This, as rescue groups call this pier, death row for pelicans. Pull the fish out. Mike's on both sides. He's a longtime fisherman and a bird lover. Unlike the challenges of pronouncing his name, he believes the solution to saving these birds is simple. If they, everybody trying the best to release and take care about those birds. Hoping the next 20 years on this pier are filled with casting compassion. In Pinellas County, Shannon Clo, 10 Tampa Bay. And like him, if you'd like to share your opinion with FWC, you can do that online. Info is linked on 10tampabay.com. There will be another meeting in February. Really?